Hello guys, this is Mauro from Infotech.com and on this video we'll go through the steps to uninstall the Windows 10 Creators update from your PC. Uh, you may want to do this because the update might not be working correctly or the installation didn't complete successfully and you need to reinstall it. Uh, before proceeding, make sure that you have the uh, uh, windows.all folder inside of the uh, C drive. Let me show you right now. You just open the uh, file explorer and then go to this PC. And inside of the C drive, you should see a windows.all folder. And if you if you don't have it, you won't be able to uninstall as this folder contains uh, the previous installation files. Uh, it should be noted that you can only uh, go back to a previous version of Windows 10 in the first 10 days after you install the Windows 10 Creators update. After the 10, uh, after the 10 days, Windows will automatically uh, delete this uh, Windows.all folder and you won't be able to go back. Actually, you still can uh, roll back after the 10 days, but only by doing a clean installation of the OS that doesn't include the um, uh, the creators update. Okay, once you check that you have the uh, windows.all folder, you just need to open uh, settings. You can do this by using the uh, windows plus i keyboard shortcut, and then go to update and security, and then go to recovery. And if you have that windows.all folder, uh, you will see this option, go back to a previous version of Windows 10, if you don't have that Windows at all folder, you won't see this option. And now we just only need to click the uh, Get a Started button. And here Microsoft is going to ask you uh, the reason why you're going back. I'm just going to check another reason and click Next. Before installing the uh, Creators update, Windows 10 also gives you uh, another option because sometimes it might be a problem with an update and if there is a, a fix for that you can download it and keep on going with the uh, with the same installation but if that's something that you're not willing to do or you already checked for updates and and the uh, creators update is not for you you simply click not thanks and this screen we get some details as what's going to happen when you uh, roll back to the previous version of uh, Windows 10. Uh, as you can see when you go back uh, some of the apps and programs that you install after after you um, you updated to the creators update uh, you will need to reinstall those uh, applications and any changes that you may after the installation you will also need to uh, reapply those changes manually. Uh, also remember to always make a, a backup before uh, going through this process. Uh, now click next. Also if you use a, a different password to sign in on on the uh, previous version of the uh, OS you have to make sure that you know it because you will need it to uh, to sign in. If you were using a Microsoft account uh, you wouldn't you don't need to know you already know uh, that password so you don't need to do anything else now simply click next and uh, now simply click the uh, go back to uh, to an early bill or or a previous version it, it will depend uh, sometimes this uh, the wording on this steps might be different but they all accomplish the same thing now I'm just going to click cancel because I don't need to uh, go back to a previous version but that's exactly all you all you need to do to uh, uninstall the uh, Windows 10 Creators update uh, on your computer remember to like the video leave your comments and subscribe to my channel if you haven't done that yet and I just hope this video was informative for you and I'd like to thank you for viewing